<laughs> In fact, when asked, they said, well, that gives you a sense of security. The reason is a couple of things. One thing has changed, which is the prevalence of what we call zero-day exploits, exploits that spread so fast. You know, the early days of viruses, they spread because somebody gave you a floppy disk, right? Or maybe they emailed you an attachment that you opened. But increasingly, these viruses spread over the internet in a matter of hours. And of course, in any virus, it takes a while to be updated. So what if you have an antivirus, the computer experts, the security experts fear that you'll say, oh, I'll well, say, I don't have to worry. And in many cases, the most dangerous flaws are the ones that are starting right now. Brand new, the AV doesn't know. So, uh, and here's the other side. Windows 10 comes from Microsoft Defender. It's built in. So you don't, I think there's no need for there are some things that third-party antivirus does, like scan attachments or for your name, and things like that. But really, the most important thing people can do is update. I'll give you the I'll give you what the security experts say. This is what you know the security experts say. Update your system. Number one. And actually, I would say update anything that goes on.
reproduce much of the value of Tech TV. So check oh, out. Uh, I did that. Uh, I saw that you on the uh, Nerdist podcast. Yeah, you heard me on that with uh, Chris. Yeah, that was fun. Anyway, so I've been watching you ever since. I know. I, I feel bad because you know Chris right. says at the end of the show as he does to everybody. What do you What do you want to plug? And I said I don't have anything. <laughs> I sure. should have mentioned Twit and the screensavers, but there well, you go. the description on the show uh, mentioned Twit. Thank you, thank you, Chris Hardwick. Thank you, Nerdist, for doing that. <laughs> I'm not so good at self promotion, I'm afraid. But that's not why I call. Oh, it's not. Okay, what can I do for you? <laughs> well, okay. Uh, uh, on my toolbar at the bottom of the desktop, uh, it popped up a little Windows thing uh, about uh, upgrading to Windows. Yes. Anyway, so when I clicked on it, it comes up and says, my NVIDIA GeForce ECX 6200 is not compatible. Okay, so both, so. Um, you can do computers? No, I'm going to get a card that'll work. Yeah, no, you don't, don't even do that. You, it won't be, a, it won't be long before it's made compatible. Oh. Okay. So just wait, and, and, and in fact, that, that little 